Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome to CryptoCast, your source for all things crypto-related, unknown, paranormal. I'm your host, Parker, guys, and welcome back to another Demon Days video where we're going to be talking about different demons, starting off with the demons of the Galatia. And guys, I'm really excited for this one. We are already on our 55th demon, which is really crazy. He is also our sixth prince. And this is Prince Ouroboros right here. And now I'm going to show you guys his sigil. And if you guys don't like seeing sigils, I totally understand. Just skip a little bit ahead in this video when his sigil is not on the screen. But this is a sigil right here. It's really, really cool. I Again, you guys know I'm all big into symmetry and everything. Very symmetrical. Um, very, very cool. I really do like this one. I don't know exactly what it is, but I really, really do like it. It's very cool and very unique, and I just really like it. I think it's cool. Now let's talk a little bit about Prince Ouroboros. So he's depicted as a horse, but he will take the form of a human upon the conjurer's request. So, as we see here uh, in his artwork from the Dictionary Inferno by Colin DePlancy, we see him kind of as a humanoid horse, which is very, very cool. Um, he controls 20 legions of demons. He discovers all things of the past, present, and future. He gives dignities and titles. He helps gain the favor of friends and foes. He gives true answers on divinity and on the creation of the world. He is very faithful to the conjurer and won't let them get tempted by any spirits, which is very, very good. Like, there are spirits out there that will tempt you and everything, and um, he will help you, you know, not get tempted by them. Um, and with all this, he is a demon of guidance. Um, and I say this because, you know, like with when he like when he gives true answers about the divinity and creation. Helps you gain the favor of friends and foes. You can see the past, present, future. Very faithful to the conjurer and won't let them get tempted by spirits. He's very, very good at kind of like guiding you down like a good path. So that's why I put him as the demon of guidance. Personality, he's very calm, very caring, very loyal. I heard his, I heard his energy is supposed to be very, very calm. Um, his tarot is the two of swords. His element is water. His zodiac is Libra. His dates are September 23rd through October 2nd. His color is blue. His directions are north and west. His planet is Jupiter. His metal is tin. Uh, and his incense is cedar. And guys, that's all I have about Prince Orbus today. If you guys like him as much as I do, hit that like button on this video. Dislike it if you dislike it. Comment below, guys. Let me know what you think about him. I think Prince Orbus is really cool, and i love to hear what you guys think. Uh, hit that bell notification if you want to get uh, updates on when I upload videos. And also, if you're not subscribed, please consider hitting the subscribe button and become a member of the Crypto Crew today. I always really appreciate it. And next week, we will be taking a look at our 56th demon, Duke Gremory, which is very, very cool. So I hope you guys are looking forward to that. And as always, you've been watching CryptoCast. I've been your host, Parker. Stay spooky, and I will see you guys in the next Demon Days. Take care, guys. Bye.